Hey guys, it's Mrs. Stanglin. I hope you're doing really well. I miss you guys so much. Let's go ahead and start off by singing Jesus Loves Me the jazzy way. Jesus loves me, this I know. For the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Yes, my Jesus, he loves me. Oh, 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 yes. My Jesus, he loves me. Oh, 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 yes. My Jesus, he loves me. The Bible tells me so. Jesus loves me when I'm good. When I do the things I should. Jesus loves me when I'm bad. Though it makes him very sad. Yes, my Jesus, he loves me. Oh, 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 yes. My Jesus, he loves me. Oh, 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 yes. My Jesus, he loves me. The Bible tells me so. All right, today we are gonna practice doing some rhythms. We're gonna use our bodies, if you don't have instruments at home, to practice making rhythms. So I'm gonna show you some different ways you can use your body, like a percussion instrument. Percussion instrument is something that has a, a thing you hit, like you can hit sticks together, or you can have a piano and a little hammer inside strikes a string and it's percussion, or you can play drums or a tambourine, anything like that is a percussion instrument. And so we can use our bodies to make percussion instruments. You can pat your cheeks, or you can snap your fingers. You can clap your hands. You can even pat your lap. You can stomp your feet. All kinds of fun ways to make sounds using your body. Also patting your chest. Pretty cool, isn't it? So I brought instruments from home that I'm gonna use to play rhythms and then I'm going to let you be the echo, and I want you to use your body somehow to make a percussion sound. All right, so first I'm going to share with you a um, screen that's going to have some rhythms on it. We're going to talk about those. All right, so I'm ready to share with you my screen. It's going to have at the top a row of quarter notes, and you're going to notice there are one, two, three, four quarter notes. Quarter notes get one beat. So in these measures, it has four quarter notes. It's going to get four beats. So I would count it like this. One, two, three, four. Now you can use another word. You can say ta to represent quarter notes. So I could say ta, 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 ta. And that might be easier than remembering one, two, three, four, just to say ta, 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 ta. I'm gonna do that once more and I want you to be my echo. Ta, 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 ta. Now we're gonna try it using our body percussion. I'm gonna clap, you can choose whichever way you want, and we're gonna say ta while we do it. Ready, go. Ta, 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 ta. All right, now I want you to be the echo. Try it. Good. Now I'm going to do it saying ta, but I'm going to try to pat my cheeks while I say it. Here I go. Ta, 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 ta. Pretty fun. I want you to try it. Ta, 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 ta. Good. Now I'm going to get some instruments and I'm going to share with you how to do it on instruments. Okay, so first I've got two kinds of rhythm sticks, blue ones and brown ones. Now, these are a little bit thicker than the blue ones. They're gonna sound differently when I tap them together. So I'm gonna play my four quarter notes saying ta, 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 ta with my sticks. If you don't have sticks at home, I want you to figure out a new body percussion that you can do and do it along with me. I'm gonna go first and I want you to be my echo. So here I go. Ta, 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 ta. Your turn, go. All right, now I'm gonna try it with my blue rhythm sticks and let you hear the difference. I'm still just gonna click them together right now. 
my turn first and then yours. Ready? Here I go. You go. Nice. This time I'm going to strike them a different way. So instead of just hitting it, I'm going to rub the sticks. Hard to show you. There we go. Like this. Now these sticks are grooved, which is really cool. It makes it sound neat when you do that. So I'm going to rub them together this time and I'm going to say ta while I do it. And after I go, I want you to echo me. So here I go. I forgot to say ta. I tricked you. I'm going to say ta this time. Ta, 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 ta. Your turn. Go. Very nice. Now I've got some other instruments I'm going to show you. This one's pretty cool. It's called the shape that it is. It's a triangle. Now triangles have to be able to dangle and hang free like this one is right now. If you're holding it tight like this, it's not going to work. It has to be able to hang and vibrate the way it should. Or it's going to sound like this. It should sound like this instead. So now I'm going to say ta, and I'm actually going to sing it on this note. Ta! And this time, I'm going to sing those notes and strike it at the same time. And I want you to echo when we're finished. Here we go. Ta, 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 ta. Your turn. Go. Very nice. All right. Now I've got a tambourine. I'm going to grab that and we're going to play it on a tambourine. So here's my tambourine. It makes a great frame for my face, doesn't it? All right. Or a wonderful crown. I'm going to use it and I'm going to hit it like this on my hand to play those quarter notes. And I'm going to sing ta again on this note. So ready? Here I go. You're my echo. Ta, 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 ta. All right, good. Now I've got another set of instruments down here. These are sandpaper blocks. They have sandpaper on the back here. And they're just made of wood and they've got little handles. Now I can crash them together like I'm playing giant cymbals in a big man. Or I can rub them together like this. Right now to play my quarter notes, I'm just going to hit them together like that and sing ta when I do it. And remember, you're finding a body percussion that you can do to go along with me. So I go first and then it's your turn. Ta, 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 ta. Very nice. Now, I'm going to show you another rhythm. I'm going to show you another rhythm that's going to use different notes than just quarter notes. This one is going to use eighth notes. All right, so let me scroll down here. I've got two lines of them right there. Eighth notes look a little different. This above right here, this is a quarter note. These are two eighth notes down here, and they're connected at the top with a little flag. So when you see two notes like this, those are eighth notes. They have one flag at the top, and they have a shorter sound than the, um, than the quarter notes have. So quarter note sounds like this. Ta, 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 ta. Eighth notes are cut in half. They're half of that. So they sound like this. T, 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 t. The sound is much shorter. So I'm going to use my uh, sandpaper blocks here, and I'm going to play eighth notes on it. So listen to it. Now I'm going to sing along on this note. T. Ready? Go. T T T T T T T T. Now I want you to try and clap that and sing it. So here we go. We're going to clap it. T T T T T T T T. Very good. All right. Now I've got a really cool drum in here and I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna take the music away though so you can see my drum better. Oh, where is it? Okay. So right here, I'm gonna have to move it just a little away. Okay, so this drum is called a cajon and you can play it that you're supposed to sit on it and use your hands to drum on it. Now the bottom part here is where the bass sound is. The bass sound is the low note. So it's on bottom and the higher note is on top. So I could play it just like that. Now I'm going to 
use this to play eight notes. So I'm gonna want you to listen. I'm gonna sing it on T and I'm gonna play it at the same time. Here I go. I can also do that just by patting my lap like this. Or I could just alternate my hands like this. Or I can even stomp my feet or snap my fingers. I want you to be my echo. I'm going to play um, eight, eight eighth notes, and I want you to echo me when I finish. So here I go. Now it's your turn. Try it. Very good. All right. Um, so we're going to play another rhythm that's going to use both quarter notes and eighth notes. I'm going to show you what that looks like real fast. And I will sing it for you first. And I want you to sing it along with me. So this one is going to start off with a quarter note. And then it has eighth notes. Then there's another quarter note and two more eighth notes. So it sounds like this. ta ti ti ta ti ti now I want you to try singing that with me. Here we go. Ta ti ti ta ti ti. Very nice. Now I'm gonna play that on my drum back here. All right, so I'm gonna play it right now. Ta -ti -ta -ti -ti. All right, I want you to try when we say ta to stomp your feet like this. And then do t t. So here we go. Ta t t ta t t. All right, very nice. Now let's try it where we do ta t t ta t t and see how we do. Ready? Go. Ta t t ta t t. All right. This time we're gonna clap on ta and we're gonna pat our cheeks for t t. So try it with me. Here we go. Ta. Very nice. You guys did a good job. We're going to end today by singing Lord and Savior. So join me in that. Lord and Savior, true and kind, be the master of my mind. Bless and guide and strengthen still all my powers of thought and will. While I ply the scholar's task, Jesus Christ be near, I ask. Help the memory clear the brain, knowledge still to seek and gain. Here I train for life's swift race. Let me do it in thy grace. Here I arm me for life's fight. Let me do it in my might, striving, thinking, learning still. Let me follow, thus I will, till my whole glad nature be trained for duty and for thee. Striving, thinking, learning still. Let me follow, thus I will. Till my whole glad nature be trained for duty and for thee. You guys have a blessed week. I love you. Bye.